so this is my review of uh, to Tomb Raider uh, 1 to 3 Remastered. Um, uh, fun fact, I used to call it, I used to call it uh, Tom Raider when I was little, so uh, I still don't get used to saying the correct pronunciation, but it is correct one, so I'm going to say it uh, here at least. Uh, <laughs> uh, so, <clears throat> uh, Tomb Raider is in my view a 10 plus out of 10. Uh, what I mean by 10 plus, it means that it is flawless, it is perfection. And uh, I think the reason why this has earned that rating is because uh, uh, it's because this, um, in lots of ways, uh, introduces people to what a game is supposed to be about, and it also does a very good job at preserving the original spirit, but making it look more modern. And I think this is uh, hands down uh, just uh, a really good remaster, and uh, and also. This reminds people of what the game should be about. It should not be about uh, um, about 15 minutes cutscenes. It should just be about a game, puzzle solving, or intellectual stuff, or interactions. And this has just the, the, the best uh, type of gameplay. Like, uh, you know, using your head, thinking how you're supposed to solve a puzzle. Uh, how to advance the game. This is the perfect example of what a video game should be about. So in my view, I have no regrets on giving this a 10 plus out of 10. I only played the first uh, to uh, Tomb Raider uh, remaster though, but uh, uh, from the looks of it, the rest looks good too. Uh, at least from what I heard, so I don't think I'm going to regret this rating. It's just uh, an insane fun experience. Like, this makes me feel like a kid again. And... Uh, you know, maybe maybe it's kind of funny because uh, this is supposed to be like a mature game, and you know, lots of kids tend to play those. <laughs> it's not funny, but uh, uh, but either way, just in terms of um, the aim of the game, you know, you're exploring as a adventurer. You are, you know, you are, and also Lara Croft has a fun personality in the older one. Like in the newer one, she's just uh, went away with this boring, lifeless, boring character. So. That's also a good thing to have back. So uh, the fact that you can play as this very cool character, but it also reflects what the game should be about, is it, it's just a reason to just give it a 10 plus out of 10. It's just perfection. Like this, all of those maybe people who really cared about the legacy of the originals. And I'm so glad that people... Uh, that that this has uh, received such a huge favor among critics and among among fans, like uh, this. This honestly is uh, uh, game of one. Like it's just fun experience. Like it doesn't matter uh, who you are or whatever. This is just a fun game. It's just a fun trilogy, and I hope they keep this up. Honestly, I hope that if uh, they decide to remaster Angel of Darkness, that they fix. Uh, you know, the rushed development or something, and then they make it into a proper Tomb Raider game, you know, um, maybe make it less about being in a city and more about raiding tombs and exploring ancient civilization and such. Like, that's kind of what Tomb Raider works best on, honestly. But uh, uh, maybe it should just be called a remaster, maybe. I don't know. Uh, but, you know, Age of Darkness, uh, we, we kind of cool if they try to fix that one in a later release. Even though I, I found some stuff in that impressive, but uh, yeah, it was definitely, what do you call, uh, not perfect. And I, I was just lost when I played it back then. Uh, but as for Tomb Raider 1 and 1, 2, 3, it, like, this is insanely good. Uh, so yeah, I just hope they, they keep bringing lot, this Lara Croft back and this Tomb Raider series back. This needs to be uh, something that should not be buried under a rock. This is something that truly deserves everybody's attention and just uh, and just in terms of gaming at large. Like, it's just fun character to play as. Uh, you know, it's just uh, a very fun, uh, you know, f funny character and and it's just fun to do stuff, to figure stuff out. Like, it has uh, the intellectual part, it has the gameplay part, it has the fun part. Like, uh, this gives all the way to uh, just perfection of a uh, game legacy, in my view. So yeah, uh, 10 plus out of 10, just play it, it's awesome.